It seems like there's a lot of branching avenues here. The shrine is right there. Yeah, but there was a Nornier chest down here last time. <laughs> oh, guess they moved it. I found something. So I'm okay with it. There it is. Ah, you all made it. Welcome. Oh, look. Oh, look. This is great. Hey, Sindri, wasn't your forge on the other side of the shrine last time? My, someone's got an eye for detail. Perhaps the light elves felt it looked better on this side. They do have a thing for aesthetics. Honestly, it I'm as puzzled as you are. But it's best not to look a gift forge in the two-year. <laughs> Very messy. Anyway, good luck. It's cool that they call it those little details. Like, that stuff I would never remember, but... Very nice. Okay. Let's sell our artifacts. Ooh. These will look fantastic in my storage chest. Oh, I keep forgetting to sell all. There we go. Uh, the Pauldrons of Might could probably sell. Finest Waste Guard could probably sell. But it's not like we need... It. We only get hack silver from this, so I think until I need to do it, I might just sit on it. What do you have going on here? Spalders of Enlightenment. Okay, so we've got the finest placard right now. And it's at level... They're both at level 3. This one's level 3 as well. Frost Awaken and Flame Whiplash. Triangle into R1. Hits a moderate luck chance to grant a blessing of runic. Nah... I don't think that's that cool. These are probably all roughly the same. Runic attacks do increase damage against status afflicted enemies. And then, yeah, runic damage increase. I still want to get the, uh, the stun reduction stuff going. I could do my... I could upgrade this to level 3. And get the stun drain reduction. I think that could be pretty cool. This would be... The thing is... The straight, like, the... The the defense. Oh, actually, hold on. So this is 29 and 9. I was looking at the upgrade. 29 and 9. This would go to 23 and 10. Which is fairly close. And yes, this gives us the healing increases. But, um... I do want to try this out. Gonna keep it spatter-free this time, right? Kratos? Okay. So, finest waste guard. We've got 100% reduction on how quickly the stun bars drain. We've seen that be a bit of a problem in the past. Let's just make sure. Finest, finest, and finest. Unless we want to get into runic damage, which maybe is good. It's just, I don't know if that's what we want right now. Stone wood. Now we need honed metal there and honed metal there. Okay. Could buy a resurrection stone. It's only 1500. We are sitting on a pretty decent amount. Let's do it. I'm only going to use that, like, if it's near the end of a boss fight or something. Otherwise, we just use Giants a checkpoint. Giants always did enjoy hiding their secrets in plain sight. Wait until you see this. That's so cool. This better impress him. Ah, yes. Here we have Groa's search for her missing husband. She was relentless in her attempt to find him. Meditated for weeks on end. Unfortunately, she found... something else. A vision of Ragnarok. Word of Groa's vision reached Odin. He sought her out. Demanded a private retelling. Didn't like what he heard, apparently. Ironwood? That's the... I don't know what that is. The mythical sanctuary for giants. 
curious. So it's in Jotunheim? I know some giants thought so, but Ironwood isn't anywhere, lad. It's a concept, a metaphorical paradise. It's not real. That was Presumably, the term we heard a long time ago. Her ashes be returned to Jotunheim, while her soul found peace in the light. Difficult to imagine Odin respecting those wishes. Hmm. The champion? I think it's supposed to be... me. You assume too much. Aye. Best not to read into these abstractions so literally. Prophecies are slippery by nature. Although, some are more obvious than others. Ragnarok. Aye. The end of everything. So this is it. There's nothing we can do to stop it. There must be a way. Why else is this hidden? Look, here. This is what we saw. It's you, fighting in Ragnarok. No, I don't, I can't. But you can. What's this then? That's new. Asgard is destroyed? That's the same as the uh, layout of the way we travel on the door, right? Asgard was the bottom left one, maybe? The other realms thrive. And Odin dies. She lied. Roa lied. Of course she did. <laughs> Odin's working off a false prophecy. <laughs> so then, we can win Ragnarok. We can beat Odin. We are not present in any of this. But that was Tyr leading the charge against Asgard. Plus, Hell's army was there. And the elves. Champion. Okay. Whoever that is, doesn't matter. But for the first time, we know something Odin doesn't. We just saw we can win. Tyr? I won't allow prophecy to define my choices. But, but we just saw No, you. Atreus. This is wrong. Yeah, like what's saying these can't be false as well? Come. There is much to discuss. I don't know if these were created or how these are here, but... It is time. What was that? Is that one of the Muspelheim seeds? We can't stop Ragnarok. But we can win it. If Asgard is destroyed, Odin will not be the only casualty. There must be another way. Perhaps oh we should focus on our egress first. Agreed. Right side! Incoming! Why was she frozen like that? Dead brother. Yeah, here we go. Sick. <laughs> oh, they stopped it somehow. Whoops. I guess it won't just keep slicing through them. There we go. Yeah, we're doing it right. See if you can parry his dashing slash to open him up to counterattack. 
Getting in close on the Light Elves gives you the upper hand against their weak forward defense. See if you can't help close the gap by tripping them up with a well-placed axe throw. Knocking off their masks here when they throw explosive material. Here's an idea. Throw it right back at them. Yeah. I would have loved the axe just continuously go there. Maybe you can throw those back at them! That's so sick. Only 15 left. Oh, we're going down. Sweet. Now these look interesting, these layouts. Oh, watch this. One of those light bombs! Careful! Wow. I was hoping I could just kind of like bounce it to all of the mirrors. Can we go down either side? Seems like it. Quickly now before more arrive. Focus, Atreus. This way. It's a rage burst on the other side. Ah! 
Okay. Not going the way I was hoping here. Use a shield strike, brother. Jeez. Ah, okay. So she's going to come in. I'm not going to I'm not going to use it. She's going to come in. She's going to do the the one attack that I can block. She kind of has like a sequence, so I can't parry back cuz she'll hit me. Uh, and then I took a couple of red attacks that I need to just not. Okay, so I gotta be much closer for that, clearly. There we go. Man. Why can't I get the shield going there? Wow. Come on. And there was a, I think there's a heal right next to me. Yeah, I tried. See, I think unless I'm close there. Man. Sucks. You fooled me once. Damn. 
Come on, really? what to do there. That's tricky! Okay. We're close. And I'm right on a heal, too. Okay, I just need to be very far from that. No. Oh, I got in. She's using the light to heal herself. Nice. There we go, baby. Not bad. Not bad. Not bad. Jeez. Alva. Winters ago, we defeated the Dark Elf King Svartalfjur. It appears in his absence, a new guardian of the Temple Light was anointed. Her swordsmanship and command of her form was unlike any I've gone up against. She was the aggressor, but once again, Atreus questions if we have helped the wrong side, referring to the struggle between the Light and Dark Elves. The only side we can take in this conflict is our own. Which I feel is fair. Here? Are you okay? Oh, Frozen Flame. There we go. Also, there's a shield here. Shield attachment. The Rond of Expedition. So right now we have Aggravation. That's giving uh, Vitality and a little bit of Luck to grant a Rage Burst when parrying. Which is fine. Defense 8. I think the cooldown buff here is really nice. Grants a Blessing of Cooldown when interrupting double blue ring attacks or parrying. So... I think cooldown stuff is, is kind of nice. So we can be using everything else more frequently. It is over. It is far from over. I... It's gonna be okay, Tyr. You've seen what is to come. I told you I would not follow you to war, and yet here I am, dragging an innocent, innocent? elf and marching towards the destruction of Asgard. What choice do we have? There is always a choice. I will not lead you to war. I won't. I'm not that god anymore. I don't want to fight. But with you three, there is no avoiding it. Your path leads to countless deaths, unimaginable pain and suffering. Whoa! Atreus! Hold on! Over here! Your chain! Uh. 
That's cool. Hey, dear. Thanks. And I'm sorry about before. Uh, I. No. I am sorry. I should never have come. We shouldn't linger. I just want to do the right thing. And according to prophecy... Speak no more of prophecy. War will not give you the purpose you seek, Atreus. Slaughter. So what are we supposed to do? Roll over? Do nothing? Enough. Hm. We will discuss our next move when we are out of danger. Does that exist? Falling all the time. I'm so sick of fighting out. Can't they just leave us alone? Seriously. It's cool to sometimes like just go in with the the shield bashing to build the stun. Get out of here. It's so powerful. The stun aspect, not the shield bash necessarily. out there. Let's go, let's go. I wonder if I'm I might be canceling that early. Behind you, it's coming. 
There is like one of those Atreus combos. I'm early. Whoa. Don't like this. I can't tell if I'm calling that back too early or how that works. Didn't use any of those. Totally should have. Like making my job as difficult as possible, clearly. Up here. the problem. Did this give me the rage? Not quite. No healing over there. Oh, bro. Oh, that was ugly. I thought it was just, yeah. <laughs> I, don't know. I don't know. I was looking to find healing, and then I was looking to bounce off the thing, and then I thought, oh, I'll just block this. Turned out to be a horrible decision. Okay. Find you. Incoming. It's just, you can't really see anything, almost. Oh, 
I'd like to have a, a skill upgrade where uh, you can auto bring the sword back or something like something you could enable in combat like in puzzles it makes sense where you'd want to leave it out sometimes but keep pushing forward <laughs> Cool, they had these little cutouts where he could be attacking from. They have to consider that in every battle because sometimes they're taking different paths and stuff. There are times where we're going to be straight up separated, but most can of the time now, he can help. Almost there. This way. <laughs> okay, boys. Here, we... Open the gateway, please. One sec. Yeah, okay, this is where we came originally. Gotcha. Okay, let's do it.